hey guys it's san bonani i hope good you all are doing great and to those that has just joined our family thank you so much for coming through and please do remember to hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so that you do not miss a video upload from me okay and to those that has been holding my hand and recently joined us as the alien family thank you so much for your love and support i value each and every one of you so if you are a follower of hip hop yes south africa or perhaps you love U Questa, then you will know what there is a list of people that uh not had demanded that he apologized to i'm not sure it was apology for what it is just news i'm reporting i don't follow them i do follow them on social media but i don't follow much on what they do or what beef they have and what stories they are involved in i just report whenever there is things that are trending about them so recently Unota, of which it was his manager, I think, before, allegedly told Umagwa, of which it is this guy that you see right here in the picture, Ubuti Agahambe, Ayegu Questa, Ayofuna, 750,000 rands, and Ulokuzane, um, what's his name, Questa decided to respond in a series of uh, Ama tweets, and this is what he had to say. I'm just gonna quote on a few then the rest you can read on your own and if you have a time because they are a lot of them so he said because of this there are things that not a believe I know that I don't and there are things that at only one magua and at TLT amazing believe that I know and I don't naturally leading to being accused of Ula Imali Zabandu as authority nota has publicly spoken rashly about myself and my family since last year and i chose not to engage and focus on the music that is what i will do going forward as you grow you learn and i do not doubt that this was a hard lesson not only for me the party is involved but to everyone else who continues to not fix the game I say that because I may owe some royalties to artists featured on Dakari. In 2020, Sony paid out a sales royalty for Dakari to uh, Urban Entertainment and Nota paid those monies over to me. We did not agree on the splits, but I stopped my pursuit of this because family members were involved in the business. I do not owe at only one Magua money and I have been helping him with rent and paid him in full for production on the latest album. With that being said, I have never taken any money that belong to anyone else. I have never robbed anyone of what was rightfully theirs. I left every cent I made on the road and threw endorsements in these accounts. Lastly, I'm now doing ish by myself and I know I will get a lot of things wrong at first. I don't have the logins for YouTube, yes, but at Authority Nota did not block me from uploading anything as I never needed them in the first place. I hope I made some sense. So I guess like on that other second last tweet that I just read whereby he said he is paying for Magwa, Irent uh, Yake and other stuff that shows Guti really Uquesta is not broke as they have said Guti he is broke on other channels and videos and stuff like that. So it says he says Guti Yena he is not broke if ever like you are reading thoroughly to his tweets and you are getting the message. He says Gutena Aga Kolo Dimundu and Aga Kobroke. He still makes every sense and he started doing things on his own and he acknowledges Guti Vela Aga Zugwens is in the right at first time. So you can go ahead and, and read Ama tweets Wake on his social media account or, or rather Twitter account of which it is Cuesta Dakar and I don't know if I'm pronouncing that last word correctly if it is not correct I'm sorry so comment it down below in the comment section and like the video share out the video and subscribe if you have not yet done so thank you so much for watching this video I'm loving you and I'll see you next on my next video upload and remember I don't love you more than God can ever love you take care